everybody and welcome back to another episode of building with sausage this is mythical sausage here hello what is up how is everybody doing today we're gonna be doing something pretty cool something that i haven't done in quite a while i want to build almost like a western style uh frontier house just a simple little western house a starter house i think you could build pretty quick if you're spawning anywhere near some kind of savannah i think this looks the best it's probably like a savannah biome but you can plop this on any biome it'll pretty lo it'll look pretty good maybe even uh a uh, a mesa might look pretty good in this style as well but uh, let's get this started so it's a very small very starter worthy uh western frontier house let's go <laughs> so uh, i got this little spot picked out which is really really cool uh and i'm gonna use these materials so we use some stripped acacia wood uh some bricks some uh brick slab uh some spruce fence spruce trap door regular spruce planks stripped spruce log some cobble a cobble wall let's go <laughs> we might bring a couple things along the way but it's gonna be small and very loud very nice so let's let's get this started so i'm gonna be using acacia stripped as our main foundation block so i'm gonna go and plop this one right here so we're gonna go up from this one let's go up one two three four and five for now okay uh let's give it a space right here of one two three four five Let's plop it right here on the sixth one. So technically it's a seven long, right? So we're gonna go up again by five. And now let's do, right here, let's do a facade first, okay? So then next up, I'm gonna go ahead and do a little cross beam right here, going this direction, right in front, right here, side to side. Wait, hold on. There you go, side to side. Wait, are these not side to side? Hold on. There we go, perfect. All the way across like this. Then I wanna do a little porch. So the, there's this porch, let's do it like this. So I'm gonna go over here, let's go in one, two, and on the third one, let's pop this up by two. Same thing on this side, let's go down, one, two, and pop this up right there, perfect. Then let's grab our, uh, actually, let's go ahead and get some stairs. And I'm gonna get some stairs of spruce. Let's get rid of, eh, for now, let's just give it a thing. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and just come right here. We're gonna go straight down from this side, one and two and three, okay? This one, just gonna take it up by one and two. Do another little cross beam right there. Let's do on this side, another cross beam right here. And on this side, let's do another little cross beam right here. We're gonna grab our fence and we're gonna fence this part, this part, and this part. In the middle here, let's just go ahead and come in here with the spruce, cover all this up right here. So we have this little front porch. Look, it's so cool, I love it. Uh, then I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna put a door and I'm gonna go and do this, watch. We're gonna go right up from here and just go up. One, two, three, four. Then let's do a upside down stair. Uh, let me grab it right here. Upside down stair right here. I'm gonna do a double door to get in. Then I'm gonna leave this part open right here for a little window. Let's take this up one more. I'm gonna cross beam here, cross beam right here. Then for this one, let's put an upside down stair spruce here and let's give it a space of one and two and give it an upside down stair there. So we got a big window right in the front, looking pretty cool. Then I'm gonna work on an overhang. So let's do this first. Uh, let's come in here with the uh, the same uh, fence and we're gonna go up right here. Let's go up by one and a two. Let's go up here, one and a two, perfect. Then let's grab our bricks and I'm gonna do bricks going all the way down like so. Take it down just to there. Let's take it actually up now like so. Let's go up one here and one here. This creates this cool little double block here in the pack, which is Jeremy's pack, if I didn't mention from the beginning. This is our boy Jeremy's pack, by the way. <laughs> Download it down below if you wanna have the greatest pack in the world. Just do it, do yourself a favor. <laughs> so we're gonna take this all the way down and then we're gonna cross over right here and have this little area here. And you know what? Let's put another little fence here just because it looks cool. So we're having this nice little area, little front facade going in right now. But Let's work on the next step. So this one, I'm gonna take it up a little bit. Let's actually take it up every other one, like so. Let's take it up one more, every other one, like so. Let's come in here with the strip spruce and take it up, take it up, take it up, just like that. And then let's do this. Let's take it up one more on this side, one more on this side. And then up here, I'm just gonna go ahead and do some, let's get some slabs of spruce. Let's grab, let's get rid of that. And then I'm gonna do this. Let's do a little stair here, little stair here. Let's do a little slab. Where did the slab go? <laughs> let's grab that slab again. Uh, so give it that. Let's put a slab here. Let's put a slab here. Let's put a slab here. And let's put a trap door there and there. And that'll be our front side. Look how cool, I love that style so much. Look at that. Now, we're gonna come over here on this side and we're gonna come down. Let's do our cross beam again right here. One, two, three, four and five let's go up over here one two three four and five and then over here we do have five long so it's gonna be another one two three four five up 
one, two, three, four, and five up. Just like this. Looking very cool. Then, is that, a, that sheep going crazy up there? Now, <laughs> what's this? I'm going to work on something really cool here. Let's actually do a little cross beam right down this way. Just actually, not at this point. Let's see. Hold on a minute. Actually, let's take these down one. I want to work on a, on a different kind of roof. Usually, I will flat roof it, but I want to see if I can work on something a little different. So, let's do this first. So, right here, I'm going to come up right in the middle. One, two, three, and four. We're going to come right here. One, two, three, and four. Then, we're going to do a little spot for a fireplace here somewhere. Let's actually work this out to be on this side. So right here, I'm thinking right in the, actually, let's do it on this side because it's away from the front door. Let's put it right here. Let's drop this down right here. Let's go up one, two, three, four. Let's just leave it at a four for now. And then we have a nice little spot on the inside to work with. Uh, let's actually, right now, since we're in here, let's do a quick cross beam right here let's take this corner bit up one two three and four let's do another cross beam here another cross beam here on the floor i'm just gonna come on here let's do this let's do another cross beam here another one here let's come in with a spruce and just cover this up for now and i like this little pattern on the floor right here this looks really cool now let's work it just like that perfect now on the inside here i'm gonna go ahead and make another window right here with an upside down, oh regular stair <laughs> upside down stair on this level so it's gonna be a smaller window i'm gonna take this up by one take it up one more let's cross beam here let's cross beam right there perfect now let's do it on this side as well i'm gonna go ahead and grab this upside down stair let's put one here uh on this one i'm gonna leave this closed in you'll see let's put this right here like that this cross beam right here take that up by one Take it up one more cross beam. Actually, I got an idea. Watch this. Take this up, cross beam. Take this up and cross beam. Just like this. Okay. Let's grab another little window. I'm going to put a window right here. I'm going to close this one off right here. So let's close this off just like so. And then for this one, let's close this off just like so. So we have this little edge going around like this. Look, it's so cool. I love it. Now, watch this. Let's do some, let's do some work on this roof. So for this roof, uh, I'm thinking about doing it like this. Let's pop these out one more, just the corner bits and the middle bits, just like that. Let's come in here with a row of loveliness. Let's put two stairs going this way and this way. Two stairs going this way and that way. Let's put another one in the middle. Let's put another stair here and here here and here here and there another one here and here like so let's do a cross beam going this direction right about let's do it hmm, let's see let's do it right here on the top right there let's do another one in the middle just like so look how cool now i'm gonna do another little bit of tricks watch this we're gonna do some stuff now let's put some slabs here 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 just like so put another slab right here in the middle okay let's come in here and let's put slab going all the way down like this all the way down like this another one all the way down like this and then another one all the way down just like this we're gonna mirror all these and then that is the little roof pattern but let's switch well just a little bit up by doing a little bit of trapdoor let's put a trapdoor here 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 and here and that gives you a cool little middle point oh i love it let's put one more slab though right here and that rounds everything off like that. That looks so cool. I love it. I love that. There you go. There, that's a little roof pattern. But now let's work on more details. Let's do number one. What I want to do is right over here. Uh, let's lift this up. So I'm going to go up again. One more. Once we get to this part, I'm going to take it up. One, two, three more. So this is kind of matching this spot. Let's actually put a wall on top. Now on this one, let's put a little stair right here on the side. So it's going to go right there on this corner. Perfect. Now I'm going to come in here a little bit and let's add some more detail. I'm going to take this up by two. I'm going to take this up by three. Let's put a little stair here, a little stair right there. Give it a cool little look. Now to break this up a little bit, let's grab some stone uh, and let's also grab a little bit of andesite. Watch this. This is what we're going to do. Let's come in here and just pepper in a little bit of andesite on the bottom side like so. Just a little bit, just like so. Let's grab the stone and pepper this in a little bit going up like this. And that gives it just a little bit more to look at. I love that. It looks so good. Now, let's get some windows. Uh, for windows, let's go with, um, you know what? How about some, we can go with brown glass, make it a little dirty looking. Uh, but it might blend in too much, actually. No, let's put glass. Uh, let's bring in, you know what? How about orange? Orange looks pretty cool. Let's do orange right there. Yes, that looks cool. Let's put a little orange right here. A little orange right in here. 
and here is double window. Okay, we got the door ready, uh, and then we got another little bit of orange right here. Now, I'm gonna do a little overhang on this side as well, so let's grab some of this uh, loveliness over here with the brick, and I'm just gonna go over right around there, looking cool. Let's do another one over here, a little overhang. Let's do another one on this side, a little overhang, just like that. Cool. Now, come inside over here. Let's do some stuff interior wise, which makes it, it's gonna make it look cool. Come with me. Oh man, let me put a torch. Uh, so let's see. Torch. Let's grab torches. Let's see. Let's grab first the door. Let's go with the door right here. Let's go with a regular old spruce. We're gonna go here, here, open it up for some light. Let's put a torch here. Let's put a torch here, here. Let's put a torch in every corner. Uh, up here, we can go ahead and put that little piece of glass that I liked right there. That looks so nice. Now, let's go and, and work this on a little bit of stuff. Now, I'm gonna separate these rooms. So right here in the middle, I'm gonna go straight up with the beam, like that. We're gonna come in here. I'm gonna put a cross beam right here on this top. Give it that torch for a second. Let's put a torch actually right in there for now. Uh, now, I'll watch this. Let's go ahead, actually no, sorry. Let's put a uh, cross beam here, cross beam here to match the cross piece on the top. Let's grab some spruce and I'm gonna cover this up right here in the front, perfect. On this side, we're gonna go ahead and put one row of spruce going up right here. Let's grab an upside down stair, put it right here. Let's grab a door. This will be our bedroom hidden in this little corner. Where did the torch go? <laughs> it's gone. All right, let's put a little torch right here. Perfect, plenty of space. Now, let's grab a bed. I'm gonna do, let's do, you know what? Let's get a cyan bed here. Let's look, let's look cute. So I'm gonna put a little cyan bed here in, let's do it in this corner, right here. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't, there we go. I can only sleep at night, I know this. Uh, let's grab a little crafting bench. It's gonna be a little tiny little starter house. So we got a little crafting bench. Let's grab a chest. And let's also grab a little carpet. Maybe a little green carpet looks pretty cool. Crafting bench, carpet. Let's get a painting, make it look a little cooler. And I'm gonna drop the painting right here on this side. Oh, that looks cool. Let's actually put the torch right there. That looks nice. Let's put a little item frame here on this side. Oh man, interiors with sauces, let's go. Uh, let's get a little trap door action. So a little boop and a little boop, right there we go. Looking cool, and for details, we can actually add a little bit of stuff up there. That might pop out. No, it's not, it's safe, it's safe. <laughs> no, it's not, okay, it's fine. We can still do this. No, this, there we go, I don't know, I like that. Ooh, even better, perfect, there we go. So we got a little bedroom action, boom, done. Then, for this side, kitchen. Can we knock any of these? See, look, by doing what we did, let's go. We can knock some stuff out. Ooh, I don't think, no, nah, let's just leave it. <laughs> let's grab a little furnace. Uh, let's grab a little a cauldron action. Let's also grab another crafting bench. Uh, and let's do some stuff. So we're gonna do a little uh, right here. And we're gonna drop another one of these. Let's do a little bit of that guy. Let's go with a slab. And it looks like we have a little exhaust thingy right here that's kind of popping out to the other side. Right there, perfect. Uh, here for this little water thingy, we can grab a lever uh, and we can put it inside a little item frame. And then here you got some running water in here. You probably don't have these in these in this time frame, but that's fine. Uh, even, uh, this is good for just Minecraft, let's go. Uh, we can grab a chest and this will be your little cooking station right here on this side, perfect. Uh, we can even do, can this work? Oh man, we can't put a trap door there. Uh, it might not work, let's see. We could do this. I'd rather have this because it looks a little cool. It looks like it's being supported. We don't. We could just put water here manually. There you go. Uh, and then if you want a little more details by adding another little painting on this side. And that can go right there. Oh, that looks so good. That looks so good. Okay, now for this little corner, uh, let's make it simple. So we don't have a lot of space. So let's make a little section here just uh, for uh, like a little dining area. So let's grab a stair. Uh, let's see, how about acacia stair? Yeah, why not? Let's do a little acacia stair here, a little acacia stair here. Let's grab a little fence post. Uh, let's go with oak this time. Grab a little uh, pressure plate. And how about we can go with, let's go with uh, acacia again. Uh, why not? Let's drop that on top. Actually, I'm gonna lift this up a little more. Do the item frame trapdoor trick. So we got a little seating area here. Uh, you can even go a little more detailed by doing your regular old uh, item frames here with your stairs going inside make it look really cool so we have all this space here we can add another little bit of carpet action maybe we do a little uh how about some gray and gray and red maybe yeah it's a little gray and red why not so a little maybe a little checkerboard action 
looking awesome over here so we still have more space so maybe if we lift this up a little more do our same item frame trick which is gone now because we replaced it uh let's go like that and drop that in here uh for this one we could add some details so the doors closed here we can add a little uh like a little desk over here on this side so for this one let's get some dark oak maybe on this uh round here a uh, little stairs and then we can go a little boop and do a little thing like that get a little flower a box oh, or a little flower pot not box Drop a little flower in here. Uh, let's see. How about we get some azures right here? Maybe a little sea pickle action, which is so cool in this pack because they're little candles. And also, you know what? We can even put a plant in here. How about we grab a little another cauldron? Let's do. How about? Hmm. How about we do a note block? Note blocks are so cool because it looks like little crates. Put that down here. Grab a little bit of bush how about we get some vacation here too and then drop that down and it looks awesome because it's that color it looks very cool so we packed in as much as we can i think i like this uh what if we come over here do a little painting action maybe a no nah, i think one painting is fine so we have all this space going looking awesome oh so good i think that's it i don't think we want to add really uh, too much as we already did enough maybe another little bit of carpet let's do some brown carpet maybe right here for the front looking awesome coming out here maybe we can add a little seats uh, I say maybe just another a little chair right here will look pretty cool right in the front add another one of these guys and then maybe do another one of you uh, we can add a little more detail maybe like a back to this something like that but it looks a little bit too tall so I'm gonna keep it just like that uh, for the front how about we add another little torch item frame trapdoor trick and that is all there is to it <laughs> that is cool look at that a little frontier house starter worthy i think this is pretty cool what do you guys think a little bit of details on the front details on the side uh we can even add i think actually i don't i don't know if i wanted to do this up front but i think i want to do it now how about we add a little buttons just to give it almost like a little adobe feel to it uh maybe get some dark oak buttons or spruce not sure let's see what would look better dark oak or spruce and then when we can add these kind of look like nails that went in let's see what would look better i can't i kind of like the spruce it kind of blends in too but it looks eh, i like it yeah let's do like right here where these cross beams meet almost like nails went in looks really cool i like that detail uh and then up here we really don't need much i think that's perfect how it is uh, a little bit of landscape and stuff wouldn't even hurt but i think that's pretty much all there is to it let's take a little spin Hopefully you guys did enjoy this one. I love this style, man. It's been a while since we've done some Western. I've been inspired. This looks super, super fun. Uh, but what do you guys think? I like it. All right. <laughs> Let me know if you guys want to see any more Western Frontier style builds. I am so down to make some more. Or any other style in general. Just let me know down in the comment section below. But I'm out of here for now. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you guys on the next episode of Building with Sausage. That's me. All right. Goodbye. <laughs> Later. <laughs>